What are you wearing? <laughs> so much has changed in my life. It all happened so quickly. Good morning guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Kylie. Thank you so much for being here today. I have taken a very long break from YouTube and I miss it a lot. I've been posting a lot of my wedding videos. I'm sorry if you hear my dog eating a bone in the background. But I've been posting a lot of my wedding videos trying to catch up because I filmed so much but I just didn't take the time to edit the videos and post them. So I'm trying to catch up on all of that. Like I just said, I miss YouTube, I miss filming, I miss editing, I miss it all. So this is my good effort attempt to get back into it. It is Valentine's Day. I'm so excited. I love Valentine's Day. Like even in the past when I wasn't dating anyone, I just loved Valentine's Day. So today I'm wearing my sweetener, thank you next, sweatshirt. I'm wearing pink Lululemon Align leggings and I'm wearing a pink, it kinda doesn't look pink, but it's a pink tank top because I love Valentine's Day. And this is my first Valentine's Day married. So I was saying how I have all those wedding videos to catch up on. I am married. By the time you're watching them, the wedding has already happened, but I just still wanted to post all of these videos. So there's a lot that has happened in my life that I wanna catch you guys up on. And I realized that's one of the main reasons why I wanted to start vlogging again is because so much has changed in my life and it all happened so quickly and I wanted to just start documenting everything because I haven't been. All of that to say that I'm back. It's Monday morning. It's Valentine's Day like I said. We went to Starbucks this morning and got me literally the most expensive drink that I will ever get from there. So it's like a treat and that's why he got it for me. But in case you're wondering, this is what I get. I am working today and then Will and I are going to dinner. Actually, we're going to dinner at the same place we had our rehearsal dinner at like a couple months ago. I'm very excited. I'm going to get to work. It's 8 a.m. and I work remote. That hasn't changed, but some other things have changed. So please bear with me. I appreciate all of you that watch my videos and I'm so sorry for the break that I took. Let's get off into our work day. Let's have a great week. Let's have a great start to our week and cheers. If you're drinking coffee or water, whatever beverage you're drinking right now, cheers. You have to be your biggest fan and when things are really tough and they're really rough and nothing's working but there's something inside of you that says i just have to follow that because you don't know who you're gonna be who you're gonna be who you're gonna be Okay, it's a couple hours later and I wrote in my planner for the day, kind of planned out a little bit of my week, not the entire week. And then oh, I had a meeting. We have a daily like stand up call with my team every morning to go over just what we're working on, if we need help with anything. I just made a snack plate carrot, green grapes, and Doritos. And it's not even 11 o'clock, but we have so much food left over that I'm, I'm trying to eat this stuff that's gonna go bad. We're also going out of town this weekend. I'm going home to see my family. I haven't seen them all since November, except for my dad, I've seen him. We all went to Disney together and I just posted that video a couple weeks ago on my channel. So I'll link that right now, but you should check it out. We went to Disney World. It's my first time going to Disney in like seven years. Not my first time, but like it's been a while and it was so nice to be back and to get to experience that with my dad and my brother again and with Will for the first time. All of that to say, I made a snack plate meaning Doritos before 11 a.m. That's fine. It's actually 10.50, so we're really close to 11. I have some things I need to work on, and so I'm going to get to work on that. I just posted this cute little video of Will and I. Well, I posted a reel, and it's like to the Mater sound from Cars, and Will loves Cars, and so I knew that would be the perfect sound to use for Valentine's Day because he loves that movie. So 
I just made a little video of clips from the past almost six years. I'm gonna get back to some work. I do have like two more meetings today. I was planning on going on a WALK. I can't say it because my dog is right now on my feet, but it is only 25 degrees outside today. And two days ago, it was 60 degrees. <laughs> That's what happens in February, I guess, in Virginia. I don't know, but it's really cold and I don't feel like doing that to myself. Little bit of an update, I'm doing my makeup. I'm taking like a quick 10 minute break from work to do it. And then I'll finish up the day and then get dressed and we will be on our way to dinner. We planned dinner for 5.15 because that was the only reservation that we could find like three weeks ago when we were planning it. This place, their food is so good. If you live in the DMV area, I really recommend going to Clyde's. It's where we had our rehearsal dinner at. I think I said that earlier. Their food is just so good. I've been really liking doing my makeup recently. When I have a reason to do my makeup, I will do it. I just find it like therapeutic in a sense. I don't know. But I've been using this new foundation. Well, it's not new, but I've been using this foundation when I do my makeup recently. And I finally just bought the full size version because I've been trying out the sample, which has lasted me so long. But it's the Too Faced Born This Way Matte 24 hour undetectable super long wear foundation. How's that for a name? But it looks like this, the little sample. I don't know if that's focusing. This is the shade light beige and it's a little too light on me. So I ordered a darker shade in, in like the full size and I'm just like praying that it works. Like I said, I've been doing my makeup a lot more. I've been finding new products that I like to use because I normally use the same products every time. Like I've used the Benefit Hula Bronzer for the longest time. And I just recently discovered this Charlotte Tilbury bronzer it's in the shade is the number three tan and do not come for me for how i'm putting on my makeup because i don't care it works for me i'm gonna try and get us to be ready before we need to leave so we can take a picture maybe because i realized i was looking through my photos throughout the years and we never take photos on valentine's day if you want me to do like a get ready with me video i can certainly do that like my updated makeup routine i love makeup videos that's how I fell in love with makeup. I know I mentioned earlier that there's been a lot of life updates. So I got a house. <laughs> well, then I bought a house. We bought it just right when the wedding was happening. So we have been crazy on the go since then. And my question for you guys is, do you want a house tour? Because I know I moved in a couple months ago. We are still making updates and getting furniture, but if you guys want a house tour, then I will certainly film that. I don't want to just post a house tour out of nowhere and be like, oh, like we got a house. Like, and I knew like when I would start posting again with my videos, obviously I'm not in Maryland anymore. Let me know if that's something you're interested in. If so, then I will certainly film that for you. And another reason why I'm posting all of the wedding videos right now is because we got our wedding video back in like, I want to say it was October. So I want to make sure that I can show you guys that. I got a new job. <laughs> So that's another update. I know I mentioned there were a lot of things going on and I left my job in December and I started this one in January and my life has been forever changed. I absolutely love my job so far. You know, with what I've learned and everything, it's only February, so I've only been here for a month, but the culture is just completely different. The people are completely different and I'm so happy. So I'm really glad I decided to do that. That's another update. And I would love to do more like work from home videos and all of that because I am now like excited about my job. And it's not like my last job was a bad job. It really, like it wasn't a bad job. It's just, it was very isolating. I was the only person who did what I did and it just really wasn't for me anymore. It was a great learning opportunity and everything, but I knew I needed something else. And that took like a couple of months. I was just talking to people at the company that I now work for and it took a couple of months just because some stuff was going on behind their scenes and I told them I wasn't in a rush. So I was very patient and I will say God delivered. He answered my prayers of getting a new job. And on that note, Will and I have also found wonderful church friends through our church. 
We started, we found a church in October, we started going, and ever since then, our lives have also been completely changed. Will and I did a lot of like online church before we got married because of COVID, and when we moved out of our apartment, we obviously didn't have a church that we belong to anymore so we found this one and we have been so blessed we found the most amazing people they're so sweet so nice and very excited about that yeah things are going really good right now that's kind of what our lives have consisted of my new job our house and the wedding and new friends so there's been a lot there's been a lot of updates it's been good it's been good challenges good changes i'm gonna finish getting ready and i will see you guys when i'm dressed Okay. Hey guys! So we're dressed. I ran out of time. We don't have time to take a picture. We don't have time to. Yeah, someone took a little too long to get dressed. And it wasn't me. It was me. Okay, so this is what we're wearing really quickly. So, Will. <laughs> what are you wearing? <laughs> Isn't your whole outfit, is that what you're wearing? Isn't your outfit all from Nordstrom? All from Nordstrom, yes. Pants, okay. jeans, shoes, shirt, and the uh, cologne from Nordstrom. I was, <laughs> I was focusing on your torso. Okay. All right, and then the beautiful Kylie Mae um, Peterson. I'm wearing Mika. That's a lady. I have Target boots, Spanx leggings, this shirt is actually from Target. These earrings are from Target. Yes, we love Target. Do we like Target and Nordstrom's lady? <laughs> That's good girl. <laughs> she said yes, we do. Yes. And we gotta go. All right. See y'all later. We're walking in. Oh we my made goodness. it. Good timing. Do they know about this place? I said that it's where we had our rehearsal dinner. Mm -hmm. Look at her. Do you hear a little clickety clacks? <laughs> this is it. This is the place. <laughs> We are back from dinner and we got, sorry if you can hear Mika eating in the background, but we got this chocolate mousse cake from Trader Joe's and we're going to try it. Oh, we're feeding each other. <laughs> I'm trying to go. She just burped. She loses. <laughs> this is really good. Yeah, this is not something you warm up. We didn't know if we would need to warm up the cake and we want to like go and lay in bed and watch movies, so. That's really good. Like really good. Trader Joe's has like the best bakery things. I'm sorry the lighting is so bad in here. We have this fluorescent light in our kitchen, which eventually we will fix. But that's what it is for now. See, that's better. If it's behind me, but like, it's pretty bad. Okay, so I was just saying this, but we decided at dinner, we got like, Will got three hours of sleep last night and I got six hours, like less than six hours. And we are very tired. So we decided that we're doing mandatory comfies, which means we're just gonna get in our PJs and we're gonna watch probably a rom-com of some sort. I'm not sure what yet. Will said he thinks he knows a new like good one on Amazon. So we might try that out. And then that's it. We have decided to do that, watch a movie and go to bed very early. Right now it's 6.44. I didn't even talk about the dinner. <laughs> So we went to Clyde's, which is where we had our rehearsal dinner. We shared a meal because we've been eating so much food lately, like a sickening amount of food. We like to share a meal when we go out to dinner because their portion sizes are ridiculous always. So we shared a pork chop and then we got two sides instead of one. Mainly we wanted like a variety and we wanted to try. So we got Brussels sprouts and we got the mac and cheese. They were both phenomenal. They were both really, really good. We love that place a lot and it was just special. And we had a realization that when we have kids, we'll be able to take them to where we had our rehearsal dinner, which that's just really cool and really special. Mika, come here. You wanna say hi? Come here, up up. <laughs> hello, hello. Okay, I'm gonna go play with her and I'll see you guys in the morning.
Good morning, you guys. Happy Tuesday. I just spent five or ten minutes cleaning the kitchen. Will and I still had to do damage control from the Super Bowl. We still had more dishes to wash. And I wanted to wipe down all the counters for like the fifth time because we made this cookie cake. And I'll insert a picture right here. But it had sprinkles all over it. And that means the sprinkles went everywhere in my kitchen. So I've been wiping down everything. I'm about to run. We have a robot vacuum. I'm about to run that so that he can clean up the rest of the sprinkles that probably fell whenever I was wiping down the counters. Today is a very busy day. I'm getting my hair done after work and then we're going to dinner with friends and I tried to wake up this morning to get to my 7 a.m. workout class that I wanted to try but I'm just being real with you guys. I needed to sleep. Felt like my body needed rest. So, so I have a lot to do today. I also have to go to the grocery store. I offered to make a meal for someone in my Bible study group for tomorrow and I don't have any groceries for that. So I have to go get the groceries. I'm gonna make us breakfast after cleaning. I was like, yeah, I'm actually hungry So I don't know what I'm gonna make yet, but I'm gonna make something and then coffee and then I'll get to work Did you have a good time? Did you have a good time? We got these from Trader Joe's. They're cute little hearts. There you go. And I guess I can put this back down. The robot is done cleaning. I just got done with a meeting and I have another one in 10 minutes and my doorbell just went off because my FabFitFun box is here. I'm very excited. The box is a lot smaller. I swear these boxes have been getting smaller and smaller. Let's open it. Also, I love this cardigan. This cardigan stays at my desk. So when I'm working, I have something comfy to put on because I get cold. I don't know how I feel about this angle, but we're gonna keep it. Okay, so it's a 10. This is like my favorite leave-in product. When I saw this was an option, I was like, yes, I need that. Cause I've run out of it so quickly and specifically the one with keratin I really like to get. Ooh, Fenty Beauty Lip Luminizer and Plumper in Hot Cherry. Well, if it doesn't focus, I'm sorry. And then Winky Lux Lip Oil. This looks fun. Maybe I'll try one of these out. Oh, another Fenty Beauty lip luminizer and plumper in the shade lemon lava pharmacy honey halo ultra hydrating ceramide moisturizer Ooh, i'm excited for that daily facial dry brush i already have one of these i don't really know what to do with this if someone wants it and just wants to pay for the shipping i will totally send it to you a ica london shadow stick and a sharpener so i'm really glad i didn't do my makeup because now i'm going to use some of these products some claw clips. Oh my gosh, I'm really excited about this. So this is like a stationery set by Erin Condren and it has just like a bunch of different birthday cards and stuff and it came with pens. So I'm really excited about this because I have the annual membership when I was choosing my things. Sorry, my dog's drinking water. I wasn't too excited about it, but now I'm actually like, these are things that I'm gonna use. Okay, I'm done doing my makeup. That took me about 
10, 15 minutes. So when people say they don't have time to do their makeup, you can make time if you wake up 10 minutes earlier. If you, that's if you want to do makeup. But anyways, I'm going to go get some lunch and then get back to work. So I'm just realizing as I'm filming this how dirty my mirror is. So maybe that'll go on my to-do list for this week. I wanted to show you guys my outfit for dinner and then not nail salon. <laughs> and the hair salon today. Hi, Mika. How cute. Okay, so this is what I got going on. I really didn't feel like wearing jeans, so I made my outfit around leggings. So my boots, they're Madden Girl boots from Target. My leggings are Lululemon Aligns, the 25 inch, the 28 inch are way too long on me. And then this shirt is so soft. Um, but my shirt's from American Eagle. This jacket is from loft it's like 40 degrees today i'm hoping that this is enough i don't want to wear a jacket i'm going through like a weird jacket situation right now where i don't have like an in-between jacket my one jacket got destroyed at the dog p-a-r-k i have to spell it and earrings are i think they're from target my necklace i actually think this was gifted to me but with something else on it and i took the like gem or whatever off of it and just wear it as a chain and yeah that's it i don't really wear much jewelry this is the ring that i get questions on not on youtube but in real life i got it off of etsy also i think this is the first time i'm filming a clip in my bedroom so since we moved this is her favorite spot and yes we have stairs for her <laughs> she's getting like to the point where she'll just like i don't know if she's lazy or she just doesn't want to but she'll just like put her paws on the bed but she wants to get up on the bed but then she expects us to do the rest so we got stairs and she's been using those but yeah this is the outfit i love you you have a good nap okay i just got back this is my hair oh my gosh i'm sorry for that big light change from like warm to very cool but this is my hair Maybe I'll show you tomorrow when it's not so bright. It's like the lighting in the kitchen, babe, is not that great. Yeah, let's do it tomorrow. Do you see? I look like. Oh, your hair does look good. Wow, it looks really good. It's like platinum blonde. Thank you. I'll just check in with you guys in better lighting tomorrow. We're going to dinner for the second night in a row to see CJ and Jackie. Yeah, I'll probably see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning, everyone. I'm putting on my shoes because Will and I are going to go get Dunkin'. On Wednesdays, they have this thing where they're doing like free medium hot or iced coffee. So we've been going the past couple of Wednesdays to Dunkin', which has been nice. And this is a, like the last Wednesday that they're doing it. So this like gets us up on hump day. I slept over eight hours last night and I'm feeling pretty good. So yay. I didn't get any clips of us at dinner. And you know what's funny is I was, before I ate, I thought, oh, I should take a picture of this. And then like, I talked myself out of it. I was like, no, I don't need a picture of this. And then I never grasped the concept while we were there that I was still vlogging today. I completely forgot. Nonetheless, it was still a good time. It was nice to see Jackie and CJ. And what am I forgetting? Good morning, vlog. Let's go to Duncan. Are you having a good morning? Yes, it's free coffee Wednesday at Duncan. She loves car rides. It's a good day. Cheers. Yeah, that's what I just happens. Drank yes. Pure sugar. That's what happens when you don't mix it. Oh, this gosh. is giving me like old Kylie and Will vibes. Like when we lived in State College mm -hmm. and we would get Duncan all the time. Okay. Hi. I tried to record a clip before this, before I went on my walk, and then Mika and Will were acting crazy. So I just went on a walk. It's like 1.30 now. And I was saying how I haven't vlogged anything this morning because I was exporting footage from this memory card and then my computer was acting crazy. So all I have to say here I am now. For lunch, I tried to make a <laughs> acai bowl and it wasn't frozen enough. And then I was like, I will just drink it as a smoothie. So having that and then I needed slash want protein. So I love these, these are my favorite. I don't like the turkey ones, I only like the beef ones. I have a meeting in one minute I need to log on to and then that's pretty much what I'm doing.
Okay. I haven't filmed in my car in like so long. I don't know why I just took these off my head. But I am so tired. I'm getting ready to take the food to the girl in my church group. And she lives like 30 minutes away from me. So Will suggested I have an Alani. And I tried this one a while ago. I don't remember. I think I like it. It's like the Berry Pop. It's like the Addison Ray collaboration. But my phone's falling. <laughs> Sorry if the angle changed, my phone was falling, but yeah, that's good. We've been loving the cherry slush one, but I like to get this every once in a while. I don't know if you can see her. I have her with me. So I have someone to talk to, because Will has a music session at six. So I'm going to pull up my GPS because I cannot drive to her house without it. Yeah, let's go on this hour long car ride. I am back from dropping off the food and now I'm waiting it's actually 6 15 I'm going to our room to start packing oh it's dark I'm gonna start packing Will and I are leaving tomorrow after work to go to State College and I have a massive headache and I think it's because I haven't been drinking enough water so I just made a liquid IV I'm going to drink that I'm going to try and pull out as much as I can to pack for the next 15 minutes while Will is still in his session. And I already started making a list of everything that I wanna pack, so hopefully it doesn't take too long. So I'm gonna go do that. And then we're gonna have dinner. Also, there's just like random things around the house that we're taking, so I need to just get everything together. So I figured I might as well start with my clothes because that's gonna take the longest. So I'm going to just start packing. So we'll see how much I can get done before dinner. Okay, so it's been a little bit. We had dinner and then Will's getting ready to leave. He has basketball tonight. He just gets together with a few guys from our church group and plays basketball. So I am sort of packed. Let me show you. I have some stuff laid out. I think I wanna wear that or just put it in not this part of my suitcase, but I have like PJs, outfits and stuff. I'm taking this like long, pajama outfit for bed because my dad's house can sometimes be really cold and then I still have to fold those things they were in the laundry I have a couple of t-shirts I never pack enough t-shirts bras sweatpants I want to pack this hat and then this is like my shoe bag this is my cosmetic bag I got it right before we went on our honeymoon and honestly it's so nice and you can just hang it when you're traveling. I love that thing, I can link it down below. It's from Amazon. Okay, so it's 10 o'clock and I don't remember the last time that I updated you guys, but I just meal prep for when we're at my dad's house. I mentioned before we're leaving tomorrow and normally Fridays, like we don't have like our kitchen, obviously. Like, I mean, my dad has a kitchen, but we won't have groceries or anything. So when we work from home on Fridays, it's harder for us to figure out like the food situation. So I decided to just prep us some chicken and broccoli and then I'm bringing one of those like Uncle Ben's microwavable bags of rice. That's what we will have probably for like breakfast slash lunch. Obviously around lunchtime, but that way we just don't have to order takeout and it didn't take me too long to prep it and then I'm making chocolate chip cookies tomorrow before work and I decided to chop up the chocolate before that so that I could make them a lot quicker. So all of that is set. Now I'm just gonna sit in bed. I may read, but I'm actually kind of tired so I might just watch TV because I'm too tired to read. <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense, but yeah, I'm gonna sign off for tonight. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I probably won't vlog all day tomorrow. I might start my next video tomorrow, so we'll see. Good morning, happy Thursday. I have had a morning. I'm working on a lot of things at once. I just made my cookie dough batter and I'm about to make the actual cookies. You have to let it sit for an hour in the fridge. So, I was getting a headache. I made a coffee. I know I have an addiction to caffeine, but we're just gonna go with it. I think this is the best coffee I've made all week. Well, Will is just cleaning up something downstairs. I've been cleaning the kitchen. Will did the dishes. I'm gonna wipe down all the countertops and then I'm gonna start 
the first batch of cookies. Finished making the cookies like hours ago, but I thought I would show them to you because I figured you might be interested in seeing they are beautiful. Here they are. I follow the Kristen John's chocolate chip cookie recipe. Don't mind all of this. This is the Christmas presents we're taking. These are all the snacks we're taking. These are all the drinks. And all of this is going to my dad's house and it's like leftover from the Super Bowl. But back to the cookies. These need a whole moment for themselves. They are so good. I can't wait. I made a double batch and it only made like 30. So it's because you make them so big. They're like three cookies in one. Anyways. I decided I'm going to end this off even though it's a Thursday. I started editing this video yesterday and there's so much footage already. So I'm going to end this off here. I'm going to vlog the weekend that I'm in State College. So I'll probably just pick it back up as soon as I end this off and then start that. But thank you guys so much for watching. Truly, it means the world to me. I love this so much and just getting back into it and editing again, it just like revives a part of myself that I kind of strayed away from for a while. So thank you so much for watching. Like I said, it means a lot to me. I appreciate all of you. And I hope I can see you in my next video. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below, subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.